of you um this is not like simple but i'm just gonna go over for, like it's a very simple toy or another stuff so anywho we've got the king cobra that's a normal cobra pen so yeah that's why i want to review now if you just pick one pen he does not come with anything right but if you get like a full set it will come with like a display base of uh, like a goldfish or maybe a lady he bought like a insect or stuff nonsense maybe maybe you'll get like a display base if you get the full set but the girl who's are just gonna count one finger so it comes with nothing um however he does got stuck to a log like this so um if you want to count the log as an accessory um you can now the details wow um first off it's sorry it's my rubber chicken so i'm planning to now first off it's not transparent like translucent so if you're wondering no no even the movie Master Kamatakun is transparent. Anywho, let's take a look at the smaller, like, detailing. Um, the snake doesn't have, like, a scale scope, but on the head, as you can see here, there. Try this. Let's take a look if I can actually get that to record it. I think I On the back of the head, you can sort of see like some spots. Those are the scales. Really impressed. Now, the snake does have some issues. One, it does not have... It has some missing paint on mine. I've seen a lot with better details, but the second time I go there when I wanted to pick it up, um, all of the detailed ones were gone, and there's only one of them. So, um, really need to get this figure, like, um, so I just pick up the one with the issues because I really like snakes and I don't have other options if, yeah, I don't pick up a snake. Um, the missing paint captures, like, here, here, as you can see here, it's just painted brown, the same. And this here, at the tail here, um, like, right here, as you can see here, there is some paint missing. Wonk, wonk. Maybe the paint is also a little bit too, like, overly done here. Like, at this wood portion here. As you can see here, there's something real about it. Nothing look actually really weird on the eyes. But the eyes could have been done better. Now, what I'm really impressed of this single is the log. Um... The snake doesn't have the most detailed, but the log is. As you can see here, the, the all of the little smaller details. Um, you've got um, everything. Like, there's, a lot, there's just a lot of texturing on this thing. Could to shock someone if this thing. We, again, really like the log. Like, the sculpting is great. The painting is great. Now, just in case you want to know where I'll pick it up, um, there is a writing here saying Lambert Park and Zoo, so that means I got it from Indonesia because I'm an Indonesian. Um, yeah, so, um, if you think this is good, it's not really worth it because, I mean, you really need to try to go to Indonesia to get this freaking figure. And there's only one spot where you could get this figure, so look for that spot now. I'm not going to tell you what's the spot. Um, yeah. So, no. But it's very, very worth it. Um, it's like, what is it? It's like two, like two, two and a half, like, dollars or something, I believe. 
no it's like no it's two dollars and like two cents like 20 cents so again it's very very worth it really shocked with the details for the snake but now i've got my ruler here and i'm just gonna size the figure up like size the figure shall we oh so the first time i'm just gonna scale up from the um tail of the snake I guess it's somewhere in between 11 centimeters or um, if you're wondering in inches, it's around um, four and a half inches. Now we're gonna compare here like how thick is the snake's head. So the thickness here is only around like, like a centimeter or two centimeters. Not Now let's just compare how long how long is the log like from here. It's around I would say twelve centimeters. With the snake it's around fourteen freaking centimeters and with finally the pen edge it's around five, six inches. So it will fit with your like other pen displays or other of your six inch displays. But sorry, sorry, just hit the camera. A freaking ruler. Now, this is the little big bites like box. This is the stuff I usually done for support stands. And um, this is not the worst way. I have to admit. Um, curve make this like having a support stand for like an accessory. But hey, what's so bad about it? Um. I really wish they could have gone like better. I really wish. Mm, no. But anywho, it's freaking worth it. So, um, that's the end of this video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below, and um, hit the notification bell. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.